morning. Hey, it's me. Today is Monday. Welcome to a new vlog, new week. I am feeling my teenage grungy self today. Super excited. I don't know why. Uh, and wanted to start a vlog right now before I actually forgot it's how. But hi, first things first. Hi, my name is Natalia. I am the owner of a boutique here in Boston that we specialize in Brazilian designers. We work with Perfect Way, Agua de Rosas, and Pitbull Jeans. And we work with Brazilian designers because I am also a Brazilian and I love my country and I love kind of representing both of my cultures because I lived in the US most of my life and also in Brazil. So to me, both of them are a part of me. And I love on this channel sharing my uh, passion journey, pieces I like, kind of showing you guys the day to day of owning your own business, the good, the bad, the ugly. And if that's on something like that you would like, uh, please consider subscribing, leaving a like down below because it really helps me out with the algorithm. If you are subscribed, please also leave a like down below because it really helps me out. And commenting something down below, leaving even an emoji, it really helps me out, okay? I love you guys so, so much. Now, this week, we're about two weeks out from um, two of my best friend's wedding. They're getting married to each other. It's not two weddings, it's just one. Now that I said it, that, that I realized that sounded weird. Ralph and Mackenzie are getting married. And today, and like things are really starting to speed up. This weekend, I'm gonna pick up my dress because we had to hem it. I tried it on last week. We're gonna have, I'm gonna pick it up this week. Jonathan still doesn't have his tux, but um, from what I was talking to the other uh, groomsmen, most of them don't. And uh, so he and the boys today, him, the groom, that's his best friend, uh, and some of the, his other friends that are going to go to an arcade or like an escape room. I don't know yet what's gonna happen. I just know that they're doing something today. And I'm excited to hear all about it. I don't think Jonas is gonna film it because uh, he, he usually doesn't film. So let me show, let me start today with my outfit and then I'll talk to you guys more about the things that I need to do today i am not joking when i say my grungy teenage self came out to play today because this outfit i think would be something straight out of 2014 no 2012 2013 tumblr okay not even 2014 because i was using tumblr since 2012 and well these were definitely my fashion inspirations <laughs> Well, this dress underneath it, this is a dress from the brand Carmen Stephens. It's a Brazilian brand that I got this dress in 2021 when I was in Brazil. And I don't wear it that much because it's a little bit more fitted and it's a knit dress. So I can only wear it either in the winter or when it's not a super hot day. Today's not a super hot day. We're really starting to feel the fall <laughs> and I'm excited because fall is my favorite time of the year. The belt is from Etsy. I love the, this leather belt. Jean jacket is from my husband's closet, but originally it's from Gap. <laughs> uh, Jade and Doc Martens. I love my dogs. I will forever love them. And then the accessories like the necklace, uh, both of the necklaces and the earrings are from Swarovski. Apple watch with me and Jonah's face on it. And then a leather bracelet that I got from Amazon. That was a quick outfit of the day because everything was very to the point. I'm gonna show you here in the back how like the weather looks. Like, look, it's supposed to rain later today. And well, let's see what's gonna happen. Now, yesterday um, I tried a new hair product. I didn't actually end up filming because I wasn't filming yesterday. So I didn't want to just insert a random clip, but I'll probably tell you more about it as like I tried a little bit more. Uh, I tried the Colorwell Extra Strength Dream Coat. I think that's the name, Colorwell, X, Colorwell Extra Strength Dream Coat. Uh, and I have to say my hair does feel very shiny, look very shiny and feel very soft. I am a little bit, uh, I don't know if maybe I apply too much or if it's like the my hair just reacting to the weather because 
I do feel like my hair, like I feel like it's way down a little bit on the bottom, not so much on the top. I do feel like my, my hair is not as bouncy as it most of the time is because I do have naturally wavy, but very fine hair. My hair is not like super, super wavy, but it does create like these. This is very natural. <laughs> Yeah, so um, I'm still testing it out. I'll probably give you more updates as I feel like if I would recommend it or not. So I did try the regular dream coat and I do love that one. I just really wanted to test out the extra strength because I wanted more of that like more of that um, waterproofing frizz control. Uh, so I would definitely recommend, especially if you have fine hair, I would 100% recommend the original one. I'm still testing out the, the extra strength. I'll give you more updates on that. And I did buy the App Chris Appleton money mask because I really wanted to test that out. I'll probably test that out probably next vlog because this week I'll probably get my hair colored because um, this part over here is my natural hair, okay? This part over here is the colored part. And I want to take my hair into a little bit more of a chocolatey brown instead of this like I'm not having a lot of time that I'm able to go to the, um, I'm not having a lot of time where I'm able to go to the, uh, hairdresser. So I haven't been coloring my hair that much and I do not color my hair by myself cause I'm scared of messing it up. Uh, and because I'm taking a lot of care of my hair and we're also having the wedding, uh, that we need to go to in a few weeks. Uh, I'm gonna get it colored. I'm probably gonna get it colored more towards my natural hair color, which is this more like chocolatey brown. And yeah, I'm excited for a little bit of a change in that in that front. So it may be when I have more time, I could go to back to red because I do love my red hair. <laughs> now I gotta go to work because I need to edit today. I need, I need to put my shorts. Ooh, I actually need to post my shorts in a few. Uh, cause I'm posting it like usually around 12 to one o'clock in the afternoon. That's when I post my shorts. I post at least six days of the week of my outfit shorts. And if you comment wanting to know where every piece that I post on my shorts is from, I will reply to your comment and I will tell you, okay? Cause we don't get keep over here. Now, let me get to work. So I just got out of the nail salon and just painted my nails black again cause I was feeling it. Now, I am ready to go home and eat some. some. Good afternoon. <laughs> we just went into Man's Warehouse to rent his tux for the wedding. It's It did not smell good in there. So I was not even comfortable with filming. Those carpets were very smelly. So, honey, yeah. what did you think about renting your tux? Well, I think that shit is freaking expensive. But you know, it has to be done. So it look good, you know, something that fits your body. So, you know, it's even worse when you're a woman. I believe. You, you went with me dress shopping, so, yes. you know. It's a nightmare. The good part about buying the dress, especially the dress that I got, is that after the wedding, I'm probably going to end up cutting it. And I'm gonna get somewhere out of that dress. <laughs> I have already been talking to you guys about how I like to get the most free wear out of my dresses. And I'm 100% going to do that with my bridesmaid dress. I'm gonna cut it shorter and it will be a perfect dress for me to wear every day. The only problem that I have a, a tailored tux. From the wedding. He but has his custom tux from our wedding, but it was four years ago. Exactly. Yes. Four years ago, I was a few pounds lighter, you know, and then, you know, that's a life of a married man. You still look the hottest. You get a few, few pounds, you know, and now it does not fit. I don't mind. Years, I was like, okay, I have a tux, you know, I just gotta put it on, that's it, I'm gonna have to worry about this. Mm -hmm. And then this week, I mean, the wedding is like two, three weeks. I remember that he should try on his tux. Exactly. She was like, hey, I uh, haven't tried your tux. I was like, no, should I? She was like, yeah. I was like, okay, no problem. And then I tried to put it on. And I was like, huh, look at that, huh? 
I'm not the same boy. <laughs> the, the the pants are a little tight on the on his. A little tight? Yes, a little. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm nice. Okay, thank you. <laughs> the pants are a little tight on his thighs because he's got big thigh boy. <laughs> and the tux is. Small. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Okay, so before we talk too much, we're gonna go to Panera. Yay. Grab a bite and we'll talk to you guys later. Bye. I am back home and I just wanted to do my outfit of the day. And I'm doing it in my bedroom because don't mind over there. I put all of the sheets to wash, so nothing's on the bed. But today I'm wearing this dress from Once Upper For Me that I got in Brazil last year underneath it this one it doesn't have this actual detail but this is a part of actually like my victoria's secret bra that has like this detail and i just wanted to put it in because for me it's always all about the details my leather harness that i got from etsy jade and doc martens and the jacket is from that closet right there that's my husband's closet that one's mine i'm not going to show you it because No, we don't need to look at that. And then for accessories, I'm wearing this uh, leather bracelet that I got from Amazon. And the rest of the accessories are from uh, Vivian Westwood. And that's today's outfit. Good morning. Today is Wednesday. I am on my way to work. And uh, today, the hair is not like giving what it I usually do to it. Because I'm on my, I'm gonna open the store and then Jonas is gonna get there. Uh, Cause he's actually going to stay in the store for me for a little bit while I get my hair done. So this color is like half natural, half red is going away finally. Yeah. So uh, I'm kind of going. I'm thinking about going more towards like a chocolatey brown color. I want to go a little bit closer to my natural hair color not so much red and um well kind of still like giving it a pretty color like we're going into fall so i think it would be nice to have something like that so uh what's this person doing there was a person like that was kind of driving on my lane uh the opposite way here uh, i got to the store not like perfect news, but better than it was. They finally took some, I'm literally like opening right now. Let me show you what they did in the front of the store. Still probably need to clean this up. But the front of my store probably doesn't have that thing up there anymore. So I'm so happy about this. I'm gonna put one of my mannequins back right there for my happiness. Okay, this one's probably the one that's going over there. Or I might put that one. Still trying to decide, don't know yet, but we'll decide. Look at this color. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I love the color. Don't mind the bangs, I did get a little bit of um, water. Cause it started raining, right on the day that I get my hair done. <sighs> but Jonas was here. He stayed for me right now. He just went to go uh, check his car. Then he's going to come back because last night we made dinner. <laughs> the bangs are just like... <laughs> oh my god. Uh, we made dinner. We made some pasta. And I brought some to the store. So I can have lunch. Oh, this is really, really good. Yeah, so I'm going to go eat. Here's today's outfit. Today's outfit, let's start with the skirt. I'm having way too much energy right now, so if I'm like a little crazy, I'm okay. It's just the energy is kind of high right now. I hope it stays. All right, but today's skirt is from the brand called uh, Gianna, Gianna World. I love this skirt. I love the cut. It's fantastic. The tank top is from Intimissimi. If you've been watching the channel, you probably already know how much I love them. I'm not pay being paid to say any of this. <coughs> yeah. I genuinely just really really love their tops and i wear them a lot even though they're supposed to be pajamas they're perfect to wear with anything now the blazer the show stopping part in my opinion 
uh, is from Agujo Hazos. This one's not available, but look, just look at this. Look at the details, like the stitching, the button, everything's perfect about this. And I just put this little like pin, <laughs> this little brooch over here, cause I always love a good brooch with a beautiful blazer. So that's why. The accessories, the necklace is this like safety pin necklace from uh, Zwarovski, earrings also from Zwarovski, belt Gucci. The shoes are from a brand called Empress Shoes, and Empress Comfort, and they're super cute, super comfortable. I got gifted these to me and I actually wore these a lot in the winter and now that it's like starting to get cold again, I definitely love it. I love, the, the, I love this outfit, I just think it's so cute and I love that the shoes kind of like give that like a little bit of the ballet core vibes to it but still like not being like super super screaming ballet and it does have a little bit of a heel so definitely love this whole outfit i would 100 percent recommend every item in here good morning today is thursday I am so loving this hair. Like, mm. <laughs> Jonah said that he thinks that the darker hair makes my eyes look even darker. And I'm like, I wouldn't consider that a bad thing. And he's like, no, you look good. <laughs> uh, but today I'm at the store. I got here and I was just responding to a few comments that were left in videos and shorts and everything. I might, sometimes I might not reply to them like, on the fly like because i'm not always like on my phone and sometimes i do like there are times that i do at my I, there are times that i do go and put my phone in do not disturb just so like i can actually like disconnect from the phone a little bit especially when i'm reading and i'm not like constantly bombarded by uh, notifications because i because like i run the stores tiktok i run my own tiktok i i don't post like officially there i just post it whenever i want to but like, there's a lot of so different social medias, like Instagram for my personal one in my the store, my friends sending messages to YouTube and all of those things. And sometimes I'm like, no, I need right now, I need for my phone not to be distracting. So I put it on, uh, do not stir. And so even though I might not uh, respond like right, right away, I will respond to your comments, okay? There's only one comment that I uh, I don't really know what to respond because the person just said that the shoes were killing my outfit and it was because I was wearing a really pretty dress but with Converse. And I was like, well, that's really a personal preference, you know? I'm not a big, I'm not a big high heel person even though I know that a lot of people would think that most of my outfits would look good with heels. So now let me show you my outfit. Hi, so today's outfit is this beautiful dress, the Manuelli dress from Abuja Hazas. I love it. I finally fixed the, the strap. So if you watch a few vlogs back, uh, I was, when I wore this dress last, I had then like adjusted the straps for me cause I did have to like take this out, cut it out and re-sew it in. But that's part of it for me, at least I don't mind. And so I paired this dress with my All Saints belt that I absolutely love. And because I wanted to get a little bit of that like more slouchy oversized style, the Gap jacket that I pretty much wear nonstop. I think it's been like such a long time since Joan has actually worn his own jacket. Cause he doesn't wear jackets that much. So my Doc Martens and the accessories are from Vivian Westwood. And that's today's outfit. Noticing that I haven't been rambling as much when I'm doing outfits of the day. I don't know if you guys like that or not. If you've been watching the channel and you like, and you see like, please let me know if you prefer the more rambling ones or if you like me to get a little bit more to the point quicker. Cause that's like a question that I have. Like, what do you guys like? Cause I can ramble on and on about my outfits all the time, but you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it open to discussion because this is a public forum, okay? Be nice about it. Well, <laughs> I just got a message saying that Hurricane Lee is gonna hit Boston tomorrow. Right now, if anybody told me that tomorrow there will probably be a hurricane very close to us, 
we're not going to be like super close okay i'm in boston by the time you see this it will have already it will definitely have already passed uh but we're probably just gonna get a lot of rain and a lot of ugly ass weather so yeah i'm not not too too scared so <laughs> that's that's one of the updates of today so i'm just here editing because i didn't finish editing yesterday yeah that's my life good morning today is saturday no i did not film yesterday <laughs> and now i'm here at the store got a box over there because i am shipping pieces out today let me show you because Last I spoke to you, I was talking about the Hurricane Lee that is getting close to us. Uh, but I don't think we're going to be... I don't think we're go we're going to pretty much get anything because it's not even raining anymore. So here in Boston, at least, I think it's going to be pretty chill. It's a little colder than usual. And the sky's kind of gray, but we are good. Now, my thoughts and prayers are with everybody on the Cape and everybody who is actually being affected by the winds, the like the more severe weather. So I'm very thankful that uh, we are not getting hit because it's very like it's very worrisome. I, you know, do not enjoy any of this. So um, my thoughts and prayers are with everybody who is being affected by uh, this hurricane and by any other severe weather that uh is happening around the world right now because uh it's been a lot going on so <sighs> now on a little bit more lighter note let me get these out of here because i want to ship these out as fast as possible so we can get to our uh client as soon as possible i'm not a joy right a hit and run i thought i loved you and you thought i was fun i'm moving on down down the road. ready to go well, um, it's the end of the day, as you can see. I got my husband's <laughs> Nintake shirt hoodie on, and I'm home. And I am so sorry, because today I was busy, and there was, like, a lot of things going on. I was on my phone, because uh, I was, like, talking to a few clients, doing a lot of stuff. I forgot to do my outfit of the day. But what I was wearing was uh, my J.D. Rock Martins and a Michael Kors dress and accessories from what I remember that one of the necklaces was from Audi Inspired. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, the, I'm like a horrible like vlogger right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. But right now, um, I'm waiting for Jonas to get home. We're going to eat something. And then uh, probably watch a movie and drink some wine. So have a great night. And I'm going to close out this vlog here. I love you guys so, so, so much. Let me out. <clears throat> I love you guys so, so much. Have a great day, night, afternoon, whatever time it is that you're watching. I love you guys so, so much. Remember to leave a like down below and comment a uh, black heart emoji. I'll put it over here. Comment a black heart emoji if you made it to the end of the video. Because I love you guys so, so much. Have a great night and bye.